Hello, my name is Joseph. I represent the company Motiva and today I'd like to demonstrate how to prepare the SDK for Windows operating system. We'll be installing Mosgrave SDK on Windows XP with Service Pack 3. Meanwhile, we have installed the latest framework on this computer already. Let us proceed to the Mosgrave homepage. and we log in using our account. If we don't have an account yet, we have to register in order to gain access to all the available downloads. Okay, so now we log in using our account. And after logging in, we can download the SDK. Here are the minimum system requirements to run Moscrief SDK on Windows. We need Microsoft.NET version 3.5 or later, or Mono 2.10 or later. Another requirement is GTK Sharp. We need at least 50 megabytes or hard drive space. But here we have already installed the framework, so we don't need to install .NET or Mono. We download GTK Sharp. OK, it's already downloaded. And we proceed to the SDK download. After the installation, we can verify if the SDK is working properly. We can test it on the sample where we download the picture from the web and we display it on the screen of our mobile phone. We have downloaded this sample as well. After downloading all the necessary packages, we proceed to the installation. In our first step, we install GTK Sharp. The installation is quick and easy. We accept the license agreement. We choose the destination folder. And we have GTK Sharp installed. We don't have to install the SDK itself. We only need to extract it to the folder we're going to be using it from. Again, we choose the desktop. And we can call it, uh, for example, Mosgrave SDK. So the Mosgrave SDK is extracted, and we can try running it, uh, the env environment using Mosgrave IDE. The environment is running. And uh, let's try running the sample we have downloaded. We create the temporary workspace. And we import the project we have also downloaded. It's called web image. We choose the project as a starting one and we choose the smartphone. Very well. We downloaded and displayed the picture. That's all for now and thanks for your attention.